Hi YouTube, it's KMC Stelo. I'm back to share with you guys a haul. I don't know if you guys um know, but I noticed that a couple of people were doing like a no spend March type of thing, and I um found out that um it was like trying like not to spend anything outside of like necessities for like a whole month, and I tried to do that last month, and I did very well I was surprised um and so I was able to save up a little bit more and um I also did work all of last month and this month so far as well um quite a bit more hours at work so I did have like some money that I was able to kind of like spend and so I decided to finally on like my second free off work Saturday in like five months to try and go to a flea market and so someone one day mentioned to me that there was a flea market in um, the Meadowlands um, which now is like I think the MetLife Stadium something like that so I decided to go check it out today and the day was beautiful I was like so happy because it's been like raining and cloudy and horrible weather and um, I was praying to God I was like please Lord like let it be nice weather tomorrow so I could finally like go outside and just have a good day and not be stuck at work all day and lo and behold I'm so grateful to God um I did get one of those days and I was able to go to the flea market and check it out and I was pretty happy um, with the goodies that I found there um, I was a little sad that I didn't find anything that was like stationary uh, like or any notebooks or stickers or anything like that um, that was a bummer I was hoping that maybe there was like some kawaii stuff or something like that but there wasn't but you know the stuff that I did find um, I was pretty happy about so let me stop rambling and let me share with you guys what um, I did find and bought so one of the things was this scarf um, it's a blue scarf and I don't have um, a scarf this color it's showing up like a more um, turquoise than it actually is it's actually like a brighter blue and it has owls like I saw it from these were five dollars they had them five dollars or um five for twenty something like that so I just decided to get one and this one just called I saw it from far away the color grabbed my attention and then when I noticed that it had owls of course I just had to have it so I got that and from the same vendor I also got this little chain and it's just basically it's um custom jewelry but um it was only a dollar and I had been wanting one of these I love to wear like simple little necklaces um because they're easy like to uh, and they're easy accessories because they're just so simple and cute and you can wear them for every day and I have been wanting one of these um for a while one of the ones with the side cross so I finally got it and the quality doesn't look that bad. It was only a, for a dollar so I was happy about that. And uh, one of the first things, booths that I went to when I first got there was one that was had um like cosmetics. And so there was a lady selling like a whole bunch of like Sally Hansen and Bonnie Bell products all for two dollars each or um three for five so I decided to get three and um, I recently tried like one of these nail Sally Hansen um, salon complete salon manicure nail polishes and I thought like they were pretty good so I decided to pick um, one up and for under two dollars that's a pretty good price because they sell these for like eight around eight dollars at drugstores so um, I got this pretty peachy color and I was wearing a shirt this color so it was pretty funny because it matched my shirt and then I picked up this tinted um lip balm from Bonnie Bell and it looks like it's like a nude pink and I love that color and I'm like a sucker lately for um tinted lip balms because I need like I I need to always have my lips moisturized like chapstick or or lip balms or something that it's like a necessity of mine 
and if that one is tinted it's even perfect so that I can wear it um, all day and then they also have this lip light collection and that's pretty cool because I got this for under two dollars and it brings like four um, lip glosses I think they're mini size though but I don't mind because I really like the color especially the last two like this one I like to put it just to kind of highlight um, my lips when I wear like a lip color my lip color I just put a dab of this in the middle and I press my lips together and it kind of gives me like it makes my lips um look nicer and this nude one is perfect um lately I've been a lot into like nude lipsticks and nude um lip glosses so I was glad to get those and then um I went to another booth where they had jewelry and um there was one that had like bracelets and necklaces all for um two dollars and uh, the quality of the stuff was pretty good so I picked up this um necklace and it has like a dream catcher on the bottom and it's like a long necklace and I really really like it a lot because in the summer I kind of tend to wear like like a boho type of look and I kind of feel like this would look great with the outfits that I like to wear in the summer and I also they had like a couple of they had a lot of really nice um, necklaces but I only picked up two because um, there was one there that I almost picked up and that I had seen on the mall um, before but I just didn't know how I would what I would pair it up with so I decided at the last minute to put it back and um, I just decided to get this one instead and I thought this was like a pretty cool this was only two dollars and the quality like I know it's custom jewelry but the quality is pretty good um and so I picked this one up it has gold rose gold silver and then a gold layer and I love it I feel like it's like a perfect necklace to kind of do, wear as a statement with like a t-shirt kind of dress up a t-shirt so I was pretty happy with those for two dollars and um, at another makeup station, I stopped as well. I'm like a sucker for makeup. Um, they had a lot of like, they had Revlon. They had a whole couple of uh, different um, brands. But I decided to just get two things. Um, and one of them was this Essie Mini because it was only a dollar. And I really like this color. And I like Essie, but it's pretty like expensive it's like a, around eight dollars and so recently I had wanted to like this color excuse my nails like I just did them a week ago and they're already like shipping but this color was my first Essie nail polish that I bought and I thought it was pretty decent because I've been curious about testing it out so I wanted to get another one and since these mini ones were a dollar I couldn't resist I was like oh that color is gorgeous and for a dollar like that's pretty awesome so I picked this one up and then I picked up one of these Reblon lip glosses I don't know what they're called but this oh Reblon color burst lip glosses and this one is called uh, you guys are not gonna be able to see but it's number 046 sizzle canicule I don't know how to say it I don't know if it's gonna focus I don't think it's going to focus, but it's kind of like an orangey, reddish color. And I don't have one in this color, and I have been wanting one in this color. So, and it was $2, so, of course, like, I couldn't resist. I had to pick that up, because that's pretty inexpensive, because those lip glosses, I think they range around um, $8 as well in the drugstore. And there was this lady, like, selling like used clothes and you guys know that like I don't normally buy like used clothes but I, jeans is something that like I will buy especially if they're high waisted and she had like these jeans and I really liked um the material because it's like a stretchy material and I like the color of the denim as well um the tag says um J brand um I'm not sure if they really are J brand um, because 
I noticed here on the back pocket, like if you guys can tell, they're kind of like, I don't know if it was that she tried to unthread them or I don't know what it was or maybe she got these from like a place where they sell like these J brand jeans, the, the ones that don't make the cut or something like that because like to me this is pretty weird, like I don't even know. Um, if I'm going to fix it or just leave it like that, I might just leave it like that to kind of look something different. But um, I kind of felt like maybe they might fit me okay. And they're high-waisted. And she was selling them for 5 bucks. I was like, you know what? Like, Let me just pick them up. Maybe they'll fit nice. This is hard like for me. I'm petite, so it's hard for me to find um, clothing that fits me right. And those kind of seem like they might fit me okay. So... And um, skinny, high-waisted jeans is something that I always have a hard time, like, finding. And then uh, I passed by another bender on my way out, and I was, like, pretty upset because I was like, oh, man, like, he had the Sally Hansen Complete Nail, Sally Hansen Complete Salon Manicure Nail Polishes for just a dollar. And so they were cheaper than the other one that I bought. But he didn't have the peach one. So I was like, you know what? Like, I can justify it. But this one is 404 Grage Gardens. And I really liked it because I did want, I did want like, a taupey, like, grayish color for the fall in this um, brand. So um, I was able to pick up two more of these. So I was happy about that because this one came out to, like, a dollar something. And this one was just a dollar. So that's pretty cool because those are inexpensive. And they had, like, a lot of... Chinese vendors there like selling like purses um I don't pretty much I'm not pretty much like a big fan of the purses that they sell in these flea markets because of the quality um I pretty much like to as of recently like to buy uh my purses from the thrift store and that they're like a good quality or either leather or like another type of quality that doesn't shed or like just come apart with um, humidity and moisture and stuff like that so I don't really tend to buy like any of those purses unless I get them from a thrift store for like you know cheaper price but I did happen to check out the purses that they did had and then one of the vendors had a purse that like I just could not I mean, I went and I looked at it and I fell in love with it. They, they had it in um, like this camel color. They had it in black and they had it in a uh, cream and like this um, other taupe color. And I fell in love with all the colors. Like I swear to you guys, I wanted to get them in every color. And um, I decided, you know what, I'm going to buy food. I'm going to, you know, see if after buying food for me and my son and stuff like that, and like going around like the whole entire flea market i'm still interested in the person if i have enough money i'm gonna left over like i'm gonna go back and i'm gonna get it and so um i did went back i wanted i was between this one and the black one and i really loved the black one but i decided sorry for the mess in the background guys but i decided to get this one like i love the handles and i love like the color of it i love the studs i love that it's like like this like it's soft and it has like the this little thing here where you could clip like it has a longer strap it also came like with this little wristlet thing over here that you can attach it to the purse or just use it as a wristlet and you guys it also came with I don't know let me see if I can show it to you guys in the inside it comes with another purse that you can attach let me see if I can show it. it comes that inside there is looks like a pouch but it's actually another purse like you can use it as the pouch inside of this or it has you're able to clip it to the inside of the purse like this and let me unclip it from both sides so you guys can see so you're actually getting a little a wristlet and two purses for the price of one and once you pull it out as you guys can see this is another purse so you can use it inside the bigger purse 
as like a little pouch to put like extra stuffs in the middle or you take it out and you clip the long strap to these hooks here and you have another purse so it's like you're getting three things in one and this was I couldn't I just could not like walk away from it I had to get it because it was $25 and you're getting like you know three purses for the price of one like it was just such a good deal and the quality of it um it feels good like hopefully it won't like you know come apart in a year or two like most of the you know cheap purses do but this was pretty cool and this is the strap that it comes with and I just love this color I, f I went for this color I really wanted the black one but um, I felt this color would be more versatile than the black because I feel like this color looks good with both black and brown and um, it's kind of like a neutral to me so I just I decided to get it in this color but if I ever go somewhere else and they have the black one oh I'm gonna have to like fight myself not to get it in black because I really really like it and it's just awesome like this is a really good size purse that you have inside and then the one that is on the outside is even more awesome like I love it I just love it and the fact that you can use both of them like with the long strap I mean I'm, I was just fell in love with this purse and something else that I fell in love with that I saw like right when I walked into the flea market and I decided to get to leave for last was ta -da, this bracelet like I fell in love with it it was eight dollars and I didn't want to pay eight dollars for it but you know at the last minute I was like I'm just gonna get it because I really like it and then it's a kind of like a bangle and I have like really small wrists and when I tried it on it fits me perfect so I just had to have it because it has like a tree uh, in the middle and I love that and it says it has like the what I love my mo my motto that I, I just love them the most it says live every moment laugh every day love beyond words live love laugh which is like my favorite little saying and it's the motto of my life since I turned 30 like I just love this saying so much that I just had to comm commemorate it in this bracelet so I I mean to me eight dollars was a lot for just this little bracelet because it's not even like real gold or anything we're not even bathed in gold but it, the quality looks um pretty good so hopefully it won't turn like black or disgusting <laughs> in like a couple of months and um it'll be worth the eight dollars so that's it like that was my haul from the Meadowlands flea market here in New Jersey I was like so happy with everything that I that I found like I love this bracelet I've been wanting one like it just like it for a while and the purse I mean I am more than I'm like just in love with it like I love the fact that it just brings like two of them and I just love this I love the color I didn't have like a big color um a big purse in this color and so I just love like how flimsy it is, how I can have the long chain attached to it. I love that it comes with a wristlet so I could just put like change and money and my cell phone in here and just, you know, leave that around. I love, I love everything that I got. Like, I love the jewelry and the nail polishes that I've been testing out and I love my scarf. Like I was very thrilled. There wasn't that many vendors. Uh, maybe there might be more come the summer because uh, we are in May right now but um it was okay like I was happy with what I saw and what I got and you guys if you guys are interested you guys uh, should check it out uh, the address of it is 50 route 120 in East Rutherford New Jersey if you guys are interested in going and I hope everyone is having a good night I'm really tired I'm gonna see if I uh, go to bed soon and I hope I didn't ramble too much. Um, I might take some pictures of the purse and kind of try and post them up in my Instagram. So look out for those. 
Um, actually, I might maybe take a picture of all the items and post it up in my Instagram so you guys can have a better look at them. So I would probably do that, take the pictures and put them up one of these days. I hope everyone is having a good night. Sorry for the rambling. Love you guys. See you in my next video. Bye.